what's good family i'm here to talk about my book I, there's a lot of misconceptions about my book and what it is and uh what can you get from it and also i'm gonna speak on four key points going into the new year as far as finding your purpose and elevating your mind so my book is about me the struggles I dealt with growing up in poverty and playing high school football, the mental challenges, the f physical challenges, and all the adversity I had to deal with and how one day it just clicked for me. And that's what I explained throughout my book. So now I'm going to go into the key points. The four key points are switch mentality, action, journey, and impact. And then I'm going to go in detail about it. The first step is switching your mentality. Switching your mentality to me is from this day forward, I'm gonna start going after what I desire, what I aspire to do, what I dream to do. Dream chasers, you know what I'm saying? Got the new tech. Going after your dreams, um, finding your passion. Uh, Cause a lot of times I feel like a lot of people just wake up in the morning and do something they don't like every morning just to survive. Uh, I feel like that switch mentality comes when you going after what you want in life, not just your circumstance. You're not just living um, in your means just because you're in adversity or you're in a certain predicament. Uh, I feel like it's mind over matter uh, where you just switch your mentality into thinking, I'm gonna go after what I want in life regardless of my situation. That's the switch mentality, that's the first step. I feel like a, I feel like a lot of times you can daunt or ponder on a situation, but that energy you use to stress can be used to progress in your life. You just have to switch that mentality of I'm going to use my energy to better myself rather than to focus on a situation that I can't handle. Now, the first step will switch your mentality. The second step is action. A lot of people talk all day, just talk, but don't put forth action. Action is necessary. Even if you fail, uh, a lot of times people are scared to go forth and do things because they're scared to fail. How are you going to learn if you don't fail? So. So a lot of times I may think I'm perfect or I may think I know it all, but I really don't. Um, it's okay to fail. I fail many times, but it's, a, it's the ability to adapt when you meet failure. So once you meet failure, you want to be able to adapt from that situation and grow from that situation you're in. So, but that only can happen by putting forth action. If you don't put forth action, you won't see the growth. And that goes into the next phase of journey. The third step, journey goes hand in hand with action. You're gonna have to still be willing to adapt. Like a butterfly or a moth, you know how they change in different environments, but they still the same. You're gonna have to be willing to stay true to yourself uh, and find really find yourself, but still adapt in different environments to, to get what you desire in life. And it's gonna, it's gonna be a lot of adversity. Um, but I feel like even when, when you're back against this wall, like, like this, you know, like my back is against the wall right now, um, you're still gonna have to find, keep pushing and find a way out. That's the journey. And it makes you, it, it makes or breaks you the journey, but it's all worth it. Lastly, is impact. Impact for me, um, it's not about you. That's what impact is for me. It's not about you. It's not always about you. It's about the other people you can inspire and impact in your lives on your journey to find your purpose and elevate your mind. So if you follow those uh, four key steps of switching your mentality, taking action even if it involves failure, and going through the journey and adapting to situations, then learning and knowing that it's not just about you, it's about helping others and inspiring. I feel like you, you uh, as a person, because it helped me, you can really elevate in life in every area or facet. Lastly, I talk about all these key points in my book. I'm currently having a 48 hour sale so my book is currently 50% off. It is $7.50. So if you've been meaning to get a book, Tyler, man, I've been trying to get a book, you know, saying that you've been trying to get a book, this is a perfect time. It's 50% off, 48 hours. Uh, I'll make some more posts about it. But hop on that, and I talk about all these key points throughout my book, and I speak on adverse, the adversity that I went through playing football at uh, Philippa Berry and growing up in poverty and just how it just really... Uh, affected the way I move throughout my life. But yeah, 50% off. Make sure you hop on that. The link is in my bio. Have a good day.